right, so this last video is about using the quadratic formula. But it's not just, I don't want to teach you how to use a quadratic formula. I know you can all do that. But I just want to go through this idea. It says in question one, solving the equations using the quadratic formula and leaving your answer in third form where appropriate. So I just want to explain what that means. Okay. Um, right, so if we solve this equation using the quadratic formula and 4x squared minus 3x minus 2 equals 0. So start off by saying what a, b and c are. So a is 4, b is negative 3, c is negative 2. Therefore, what negative b is going to be 3, b squared is going to be 9, 4ac is going to be 4 times 4, which is 16, times negative 2, so that's going to be negative 32. And 2a, that's going to be 2 times 4, so it's 8. Okay, um, so we've got x equals negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac. Like even when I try my best not to, I almost break into that quadratic formula song. So sad. Okay, so if we substitute all our numbers in now, we will have uh, 3 plus or minus the square root of b squared, which is 9, minus minus 32, so it'll be a plus 32, all over 2a, which is 8. So if we tidy that up, we will have x equals 3 plus or minus the square root of 41, all over 8. Okay, we can split that up. We can have x equals 3 negative 41, over 8, or x equals 3 plus 41 over 8. Okay, and that's what third form is there. You just literally leave it as a third. You don't work it out. Okay, that's all. All right, off you go then. Um, exercise 3 should be nice and easy to do now. Okay, actually when you leave them in third form, it's less work to do because you know you're not going to use your calculator to get that answer. And that's actually quite important. If you've been asked to put it in third form, okay, do not use your calculator to write this out to something, to three significant figures, okay? You make sure that you leave it in that form there. You carry on and you get the decimal answer for those two things. The answer is no longer in third form, so you've not given it in the answer uh, in the form that you've been asked to. Okay, so make sure you don't. Right, off you go.